YouTube, what's going on today? I hope you guys are having another good day. Today is Saturday. It's the weekend, Labor Day weekend. College football is in the air. It's a good time, guys. Uh, super pumped. So happy for college football to be back. I, I'm y'all. Just a heads up, y'all ain't gonna get a video Monday. Uh, you might get one Monday morning, or sorry, tomorrow morning, but not definitely not in the evening because I'm gonna be drinking. I'm gonna be watching some Hurricanes versus LSU. It's gonna be a good game. Um, but yeah, definitely. Hey, thank you guys so much for all the love you guys have given me in my previous videos. Uh, I really appreciate it. I've been gone all week. Uh, I've been expecting to have the Cummins back since Wednesday. She ain't back yet. Uh, we're still whipping it in the old school Chevrolet. All right. But she's been riding good, man. This, this is a good, this is a bomb ass riding truck. It rides good. But uh, yeah, so we got a new video today gonna be getting, bringing you guys uh, a unboxing a company sent out to me um, I'm very grateful for it they reached out to me and said hey we would like you to try out one of our products I said absolutely without a doubt because you know free products means free parts uh, I will be making an unbiased review on it I was looking at my dog I will be making an unbiased review on it um, letting you guys know what I think about it and st such and such so pretty much quick update with the Cummins I stopped by there today the new windows in the dents repaired and they painted it uh, I could have got it yesterday but they had just painted it and I did not I didn't want a chance of taking it out I wanted the paint to be able to sit and dry it fully over the weekend um, one thing I don't like to rush is body work when it comes to body work I try to let the people have their time I, I, you know if it takes them a little longer than expected it's fine I just want it to come out right I want it to come out professional I, I want it to look good okay so I don't I try not to rush body work you know uh, I'm not a, like I said, you guys know I'm, I'm whipping the old school Chevy, all right? So I'm not in a rush to get into my truck, although I do miss her, and I can't wait to get back in it. Rollo, come here. Come on. And I do I do want to uh, I want to drive her again, and she's going to be filthy. So we have some unboxing of stuff I want to show y'all, all right? Now, this company I'm going to show y'all, they sent me a light bar, okay? So we got a light bar coming for the, for the, uh, for the Cummins, all right? Oh no, another box inside of a box. All right. So I got a uh, light bar from Oxbeam. Pretty sure it's a 42 inch, either a 42 or 46. I think it's a 42 inch. 42 inch light bar from Oxbeam. They reached out to me. Um, they sent it out to me. It is a 5, 5G uh, Creed LED uh, full color RGB. So you not only do I get the white color, I also get to choose and change the colors of the light bar. Um, let me get my box knife. And let's go ahead and open up this bad mama jamma. See if I can do this with one hand without messing it up. Uh, okay. So, we got that. We got that. And it, oh man, you guys, it is hot as hell outside today, man. I think it's like 91 right now. It's blazing, man. You can't you can't run away from the heat out here. So if you see me sweating, it's because I'm hot. Okay. All right. Wow. So first thing off the bat, we got our relay harness right here. <clears throat> packaging, first of all, this is the packaging you'll get. Uh, you'll get a box inside of a box. So first off, I know... A lot of people don't care, but I think when you're making a review video or when you're receiving products, packaging is a huge deal because there's been so many times I've gotten packages. I one time I got parts and the box was the corner was open and the part was hanging halfway out of it. And I was like, what the hell? You know, it's like they, you can tell a company's craftsmanship, work work ethics and stuff like that based off of how they box and package something, right? Sounds cliche, but I'm I'm old school. All right, so we got a relay harness here. Ooh, and we got an on and off uh, tr trigger switch. Check that out! Wow. And yes, I will have a link below for this product. Um, and Oxbeam was also nice enough to go ahead and give me a promo code for you guys. You guys will get a 15% code off if you purchase this. Okay, so make sure you check out the comment and description below so you can get that discount code. Because not only will you be getting a probably most likely good, uh, uh, what you call it, light bar, but you also get 15% off. So this is what I got. I got a RGB light bar by Oxbeam. Uh, you can control it with the app to change the colors. 
uh, wiring these up is not hard at all. It's pretty simple. So, I mean, look at this. They give you, God damn it, one hand wonder. They give you uh, full out instructions showing you what all comes with it and how to wire it up. And this looks pretty easy. Okay, okay. So we got the controller box right here. So this is going to be the controller box so that way it can con you can control the colors and stuff like that with it. Uh, they, they give you everything, okay? You won't, it's not like these cheap LED bars where you get the LED bar, but then you got to buy the harness, the switch, and then uh, brackets. No, you get all of it with Oxbeam, okay? Oxbeam makes really good products. Oh, sweet. They sent me out a sticker. Well, you know where this is going. That way, Rilo. This is going to go somewhere over here. Hell yeah. Okay, this is just a little review card. Very nice, very nice. Uh, let's see what else we got. Ox beam side bottom mount instructions. So I guess these are instructions on how to mount it to the vehicle. Um, and all honestly, I don't think I'm probably going to look at this because it can't be that hard to mount this. So, cool. Okay. Nice. Now, let's get to what you guys want to see. Might have to do two. Yeah, I'm going to need two hands for this. Be right. All right, you guys, I went ahead and took it out the box. So right, right now, what we're looking at is a 42-inch curved RGB 5G Creed LED light bar, okay? This is pretty nice looking. This is fancy. Uh, high quality right so far off, the t off of it, looking at it, everything is really high quality. It doesn't look cheap, flimsy, like some Chinese knockoff light bars you can get on Amazon and eBay. Um, this looks looks clean very professional curve okay now I know you guys are probably wondering well you're like well how is this gonna fit in, in front I'm gonna remove the tow hooks off the Cummins uh, this is just me personally I don't use them I never have if anybody has used them it's probably not a whole lot of people because most of us have them and we just let them sit there I know I, these ones I have I never used them uh, my last truck never used those either so this is a nice little light bar okay and ox beam Thank you very much for sending me this out. If you're watching this, um, like I said below, you will have a link to the light bar, okay? So you'll be able to get the light bar. And I wanted to show you guys this, all right? Because I know you guys are going to ask me. It does come with mountain hardware, okay? Check this out. And they even gave you the little Allen keys for it. So this is the relay harness right there I already showed you. And here's our mount brackets. Oh, yeah. Nice solid, okay? This is in plastic, metal. All right, you see, look in there, okay? You know, solid metal. Okay, so this is it's good. Good stuff. Good stuff. I like it. Oh, and, and I got two stickers. So they gave me one, and, they, and then also they gave me two actually. So we got this stuff right here. Okay, now what I wanted to show you guys next was some car washing products I got. So I went ahead, made two orders: one from Adams and one from Chemical Guys. Okay, let me get this set up over here on this hood. I went ahead and ordered from Chemical Guys some Honeydew Snow Foam. Apparently this is like, I follow, so you guys know, I follow auto detail channels because I'm pretty big into auto detailing. I like watching videos on it and I like, you know, detailing cars and stuff like that. And I follow uh, a lot of guys and apparently they rave that when it comes to not car wash soap, but just foam soap, soap that you want to use for your foam gun, they say you can't go wrong with Honeydew. Uh, I watched a comparison. If you guys haven't heard of this channel, his name's Auto Fanatic, dude up based out of New York, upsta up, upstate cool guy who makes awesome detail videos and he did a comparison with this versus the Adams Ultra Foam shampoo and this knocked it out the park okay now is it a hundred percent you know unbiased probably not but he had very valid points in his videos next up is uh, this one right here is called Mr. Pink shampoo uh, this is just a good wash soap so that way like if you already wax and washed your truck like let's say you polished and wa waxed it you know a couple weeks ago you don't want to wash that or remove those uh, protectants on your paint. So you want to use a soft pH neutral uh, soap. This is it right here, okay? Both of these will not strip your uh, your wax. And then also, I got this because I got a white truck and this is very, very, very important to have, okay? I got some decon iron remover. So pretty much what this is, is you guys know the fad where people like to buy the rim cleaners that when you spray it on the rims, it changes colors and it turns purple and you can see the dirt removing. That's what this is. All that is is an iron remover, okay? So uh, your brake pads on your vehicles, 
they release a lot of iron, a lot of dust, just a bunch of gunk, and it gets all along the side of your paint. Well, having a white vehicle, you, it, it shows a lot easier, okay? So what happens is you'll start seeing like little, 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 little tiny rust speckles, and you'll be like, is my paint rusting like already? Like what the hell? No, that's just the iron embedded underneath your paint surface. So in this, in, on a white vehicle, you can see it a lot easier. So I got some of this because this is gonna make that, it's gonna take all that out of my paint, make it a nice solid white. And best of all, I got another box too. This one is from Adams. Best of all, uh, my truck is gonna probably be really dirty when I get when it gets back. So I'm looking forward to it. Now, this one I got is Adams Tire Shine. Okay, I watched a video on this. Adams polishes. Now they do make very good products, uh, and I just bought them, so I'm gonna show you guys them. I have used them in the past. If I can get it out the box. Okay, had some technical difficulties, but we're good. So right here, from Adams Polishes, I bought Ceramic Boost, okay? I will be making a video showing how I polish my rim, or not polish, how I shine my wheels and tires, um, and it's a combination of both of these products, okay? Uh, this stuff right here is amazing, I love this. And this is the updated uh, formula, because I have a bottle of the original Ceramic Boost. This is the 2.0. Uh, you can use this on your paint, you can use this on your rims. It, I like to use this on my rims. I don't use this on my paint, really, because my, my truck's not ceramic coated, and even though I have some in the garage, it's not just because I haven't had time. So this stuff is amazing. Uh, it it gives it a nice sheen, and it bounces water off of it. It beads it off ridiculously. Okay. Next is the tire shine. I'm, now this is I've never used before, but I've watched videos and reviews, and this is supposed to be amazing. It is not silicone based, um, which is what I'm looking forward to. And apparently, you can get a wet shine that lasts a long time with it also got some two little applicator pads and and uh, two microfibers polishing okay so we got some good stuff here good stuff I got Adams polishes chemical guys uh, I'm going to California next month for a wedding from one of my uh, one of my brothers that I used to be stationed with going to his wedding I do plan on stopping at chemical guys uh, shop up in LA to check him out okay so this is all we got we got some chemical guys, Adams polishes, aux beam, light bar, okay? So we do have things for the channel. So please, I know you guys, the videos have been coming out at a slow rate recently. You guys all know my truck's missing right now. Um, just hang in there, stick with me. I really appreciate it. I'm going to be back, okay? I promise you guys that. So until next time, you guys take it easy. Peace out, be safe. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. If you enjoyed this video, do me a favor and give me a thumbs up because it means a lot to me. It helps the channel out so much. Uh, I've reached out to some companies for sponsorships and willing to work with me. I got word back from some of them. I'm not going to release that info yet until it's all solid and, you know, everything's T's are dotted, I's dotted, T's crossed, all that crap. Uh, once that happens, I'll let you guys know, trust me. But we, we're working, man. We got things happening for the channel. So. Until next time, you guys, please have a good weekend. Be safe. Don't drink. Don't drive this weekend. Labor Day weekend. Enjoy some college football. And you guys have a good weekend. And until next time, I see y'all. Peace out. Be safe.